running it's just your body against gravity and as you go further and further that gravity works harder and harder and you start to break down and there's no relief at all and it becomes just a battle between your head and your body and trying to keep going you just feel uncomfortable all the time I can go for miles 20-30 miles in total discomfort almost screaming for it to stop and the pain will move around your body The Arch to Arc is arguably the world's hardest triathlon. It consists of an 87 mile run from Marble Arch in London down to Dover. From Dover I then dive into the English Channel and swim 22 miles to Calais and then from Calais cycling 181 miles to the Arc de Triomphe in Paris where the event ends. When I swim I don't want to know anything about time or distance. It's really important that I don't know where I am or how fast I'm going. I just need to be in the water with myself. I focus on things like my stroke. There will, of course, be dark places. There will be really dark times. And I have to be really careful I don't dwell on those, especially in the water. If I've got to Calais and I'm on that bike, I've got to finish. It's really important. I need to take things very carefully. I know the body will have broken down, but at least I know that the cycle is aided, aids me, gears, the pedals, the mechanisms will get me there. And even if it means stopping, taking my time, eating loads, I need to use the bike to get me there. There'll be a point when it's all over, I'm clean and I'm washed and I'm warm but somebody's going to hand me a cup of tea and that cup of tea will be the best cup of tea that I've ever had it will be a fantastic feeling and just for that moment it will all be worth it